snark on social media is part of the experience and it doesn't matter whether you're on Twitter, Facebook or Snapchat. Following the Los Angeles loss last night to the Red Sox, there were plenty of people ready and waiting to take their shots at the Dodgers. But it wasn't just opposing fans. The Texas Rangers actually went with a tactic that was a slight poke but fairly self-deprecating overall, hey at Dodgers, the support group for back-to-back. Texas Rangers, at Rangers, October 29, 2018 As you'd expect, plenty of people failed to read the nuance, which is even more of a social media hallmark than snark itself. Just go with it bro, Texas Rangers, at Rangers, October 29, 2018 Think asterisk, Texas Rangers, at Rangers, October 29, 2018 The NBC Sports Bay Area's Giants account really twisted the knife on the Dodgers with this tweet, though, congrats to the Dodgers on another World Series appearance. Pick.twitter.com slash jackserpzoi, SF Giants on NBCS, at NBCS Giants, October 29, 2018. There was this follow-up, as well, Kirk Gibson ain't walking through that door, and the Dodgers' title drought just hit three decades. Via Dalton underscore Johnson, https colon slash slash t.co slash zwksgg2 philpic.twitter.com slash erk5 nipzub, sf giants on nbcs, at nbcs giants, october 29th, 2018. It's funny, the Dodgers have won more games than the Giants every season since 2012, and while the Giants do obviously have the 2014 World Series during that stretch, the Dodgers have pretty clearly been the better franchise overall. Plus the Giants just won 73 games this year, which was somehow a 9-game improvement over 2017. And even then, someone at the Bay Area Network was cranking up the trophy graphic. It might rub some people the wrong way, but it's a bit refreshing to see rivalries that are treated as such. And it's much more interesting to talk about than a few, congratulations to the Dodgers, tweets would have been. ESPN Nacho's in a tough spot when commenting on Texas games, which he acknowledged. By Jay Rigdon on Oct 29, 2018 ESPN For the fourth time since 2004, the Boston Red Sox are World Series champions after beating the Luss. By Matt Clapp on Oct 29, 2018 By Matt Clapp on Oct 28, 2018 CBS This was just kind of uncomfortable all around. By Jay Rigdon on Oct 28, 2018 ESPN, they said, We're looking for a different sound, by Philip Bubb on Oct 27, 2018 ESPN Game Day returns to Jacksonville for the first since 2005 by Jill Wisnant on Oct 27, 2018 ESPN at shows in a tough spot when commenting on Texas games, which he acknowledged. By Jay Rigdon on Oct 29, 2018 ESPN for the fourth time since 2004, the Boston Red Sox are World Series champions after beating the Luss. By Matt Clapp on Oct 29, 2018 By Matt Clapp on Oct 28, 2018 CBS This was just kind of uncomfortable all around. By Jay Rigdon on Oct 28, 2018 ESPN They said, we're looking for a different sound. By Philip Bupp on Oct 27, 2018 ESPN Game Day returns to Jacksonville for the first since 2005 By Jill Wisnant on Oct 27, 2018